Real quick before the video, I'm currently working on some merch. I already have some amazing ideas, but be sure to comment below any ideas you have. And maybe it'll become a shirt, cause I wanna know your ideas too. Can't wait to read your ideas. Enjoy the video. I love being disturbed. Do you too? Great, time to get disturbalicious. Hey, it's Lucas, welcome back to the Chan Chan. So we've all experienced some quite disturbing episode stories together in the past. I go on episode, I find random episodes that nobody's read, and usually they involve plastic surgery, dungeons. Somebody brought it to my attention in my Instagram DMs that there's an episode story about me. Lucas Kirkshank, I'm so excited. Someone made a video game about me. It's doing really well. So far, eight people have read it. Hey, look, Ma, I'm me. Made it. Lucas Crookshank, Road to Fame. Hell yes. After Lucas, Fred's career ended. This is about after my career ended? What the f Everything in this story was ideas from Lucas or things he likes. There's three episodes and more episodes coming soon. So I guess this is a whole story about me trying to regain fame? Sounds very depressing. Let's play. This story goes out to the one and only Lucas Crookshank. Good, because I'm the only one reading it. Everything in these stories are suggestions from Lucas or things Lucas has talked about. Don't forget to tweet him so you can react to this story and maybe make a video on it. We're doing it, sis. Wait, that's me? I look like Brad Mondo. My personal theory is that every single male character on this app looks like Brad Mondo. My hair doesn't go like that, but go off. Also those shorts. Come on now, I wouldn't wear those. They have like a weird side pocket where like dads put screwdrivers. Whatever, I'm not gonna comment on the clothing. Also, I like how there's a muscular man on my wall. Just, you know, have the men plastered on the wall of my bedroom. Guys, all I'm saying is Hannah Montana would have been better if there was a sugar baby, sugar daddy storyline to it. Am I just talking to myself? Obviously, I would play Billy Ray Cyrus as sugar baby. There was no context. Like, was I filming a video? Was I just talking to myself? Was I talking to an imaginary person? It all started in my favorite cafe where I get my coffee before I film a video. Oh my god, they know me so well. Except I make this in a Keurig. So you have that wrong. Change the story. He wasn't my dream man. He just had loads of money. <laughs> Is this gonna be about me getting lured into the world of sugar daddies? I'm so down for this. Oh my God, who's this man who just walked up? If I wanted to become famous, I had to have loads of money and he would be the one to provide it. Is this my sugar daddy we're looking at? Wait, is that Billy Ray Cyrus and Hannah Montana? Dad, I have a show in six hours. We need to leave right now. You're underrated now, Hannah. The kids have moved on from you exposing yourself every show. Oh my God, I love how in this universe, Hannah Montana is now exposing herself during her concerts. I'm so on board. How dare you? I wonder who that boy is. Oh my God, Billy Ray Cyrus is noticing me. He looks broke. All right. And that's how this mess began. This whole entire story is gonna be about me banging Billy Ray. Ugh. I feel like I wrote this myself, like while I was half asleep because it's just everything I want. Ring. Oh my God, please say it's Billy Ray calling me. Hello? Hi, this is Billy Ray Cyrus here offering you a job you can't resist. Wait, I'm yawning. Why am I yawning? If Billy Ray Cyrus called me and offered me anything, I would take it. I would clean his kitty litter boxes. Weirdos. Look, I don't want any more prank. Oh, I thought it was a prank call. I'll pay you an allowance of $500 each each week just to be my sugar baby. Nah, I'm good. Okay, the person who wrote this doesn't know me. What can I do to make you my sugar baby? I actually just wanna be Hannah Montana. Am I gonna become transgender in this? I'm so down for this storyline. And those words is how the chaos began. I can't believe you are firing me. It's my show. Hannah, you weren't good anyways. People are getting bored. Hannah Montana would never get old, so you. You can never find anyone to replace me. <gasps> Actually, we did. Is that me? I've switched genders. After that, Hannah went crazy. She got sent to jail for five years. Why? Did she not pay her taxes? What's the tea? She's a changed person now. It's kind of scary. Just smoking in jail, I love it. And that's how I landed here. I now go by Hannah, and I'm living the best of both worlds. This storyline is so messed up when you think about it. Billy Ray was attracted to Lucas, and now Lucas looks like his daughter. Does anyone see what's wrong with this? I'm disturbed. Welcome, folks, to the MTV original show. Oh my gosh, did me and Billy Ray have our own reality show? Just like Jersey Shore, except it's like, 
Billy Ray and his daughter, but they're secretly dating because the daughter is actually Lucas Crookshank, where we get singles to find the love of their life through a bus. Now let's get this show on the road. Are we now entering the MTV reality show next about the bang bus that I've done a video on before? Careful what you do because you may be next. Hi, my name is Dave. I'm 23 years old and I like rocks. My name's Chase. I'm 19 and I love getting this bread. I'm Albert and I'm 100% 20 years old. Now that we have met all of our contestants, let's start. But after, we might find the hot single they will be fighting for. It's Billy Ray Cyrus. I like how the story just completely switched. Like what happened to me being transgender, being Hannah Montana? Now we're just watching Billy Ray Cyrus date other men? I'm now jealous of these other men that are possibly gonna date Billy Ray. Oh my God, I'm back to being a man, I guess. I'm so confused, like I was backstage with the contestants like looking all worried that Billy Ray's meeting all these singles. Hey. Hey. So what are your favorite hobbies? I like the gym and hot dudes. Are you dumb? Liking hot dudes is not a hobby. Next. Billy Ray Cyrus is a savage. Oh wait, I guess I'm a contestant on the show. I'm lost. I think maybe now we're just switching everything and like Hannah Montana didn't happen. Now it's just a new storyline. Okay, I'm on board. You've gotta be kidding me. Oh, it's real. I sense tension. Why is there tension? Nothing even has happened. <laughs> nope, nope, I can't do this. I'm turning down Billy Ray Cyrus, but you will. You're pressuring me a little bit too much, Billy Ray. Come back here, boy. Why did I just run away from Billy Ray Cyrus? I didn't even make him follow me from his Instagram. I didn't make him shout me out on his Instagram story. I'm doing this completely wrong. The surgery. This is going all over the place. I liked it when I was Hannah Montana. Then we went through a dating show where I turned down Billy Ray for some unknown reason and now I'm getting a surgery. I know I'm not in high school, but I just had to relive my high school experience. Why am I so pathetic in this? So I enrolled in the nearest high school. <laughs> I would never want to go back to high school. People are always like, high school is the best years of your life. I remember thinking that in high school and I was like, well, if that's true, life sucks. It's not the best years of your life. If you peak in high school, that's a problem and you'll probably be pregnant with triplets by 18 and a half years old which is also fine get on MTV it's near the end of second semester so let me catch you up to date there's this hot guy named Matthew wait I'm dating a high schooler this is very problematic that's not okay for some 20 something to go to high school and date the minors this is going in a bad direction is he gay we don't know but we do know he's a high schooler so we probably shouldn't be dating him if he's writing a book report on the great Gatsby he's too young for you Kiki, the popular girl who had plastic surgery, is now running for prom queen. I need to put a stop to this. I'm a grown man. Why am I wasting my time in a high school trying to stop the plastic surgery prom queen? This actually sounds like something I would do. Go to a high school, somehow try to fight the popular girl, end up getting butt injections. They know me too well. Tonight is the night. It's what every high school kid dreams of. Well, you're not in high school, Lucas. Get a job. People your age have kids and you're in high school creeping around trying to stop the prom queen. Get some goals and try to accomplish them. Cause these aren't it, son. Prom! Now yes, this is my second prom. Second time's the charm, right? No, stay away from the high school. Haha, -ha, I look great. Now since it's my second prom, my mom said I had to walk because she didn't want to pay for a limo. Well, your mom doesn't have to pay for anything, Lucas. You're a grown man, move out. You're trying to make your mom pay for a limo? She has a job. She has bills to pay. She's not gonna buy you a limo when you're creeping around high school. I like how in this story, my mom knows I'm like sneaking into a high school and is just kind of on board with it. It was fine because now I gotta think of how to stop Miss Plastic Surgery Kiki from getting that crown. I want prom queen. I hate myself in this. I arrived and saw Kiki first. She of course looked stunning. Gather around as we crown our prom king and queen. Our prom queen, Lucas Crookshank. Everyone in the audience is like, he goes here? Wasn't he on that alien show that only lasted one season? Isn't he way older than us? Why is he here? Call 911 immediately. Wait, what? And our prom king, Matthew. This can't be happening. Can we have a king and a queen for their dance? 
Um, uh, this poor high schooler, Matthew, is like, what's going on? I was really excited to win Prom King, but now I'm having to dance in front of all of my peers with a gay 25 year old man. This isn't what I envisioned my senior prom to be. I guess it was one beautiful night so uncomfortable. His eyes sparkled, probably with tears of embarrassment and confusion. He even walked me home. He's probably trying to walk you to the police station, Lucas. He's concerned for your mental health. Why are you at our high school? You already graduated, son. Leave, move on. He kissed me. This isn't right. <laughs> This is not right at all. What is this? And then I woke up. Oh, that was all a dream? I just hallucinated for like half an hour. Kiki. So Kiki actually got prom queen. And our king, Matthew. They danced the night away. Kiki is literally fake. Her butt is not real, people. And I had to get Matthew all to myself. Lucas. Leave the high school premises, work at a gas station, maybe Walgreens, just do something. You've reached the end of the story? Why did these always end in the best moment ever? We were just gonna see if Lucas was gonna murder the prom queen to try to get to Matthew, who's a high schooler, so why is he even trying to date him? There was a lot that was gonna happen. Well, I guess that's that person's interpretation of me, a little concerning. Am I coming off to you guys that I would want to date a high schooler? That I want to sneak into a high school? Like what? I need to rethink my whole life. What the f Well, thank you guys for coming along on this journey. Thanks to whoever created that story. You know, you did it. My personal favorite was definitely the storyline where I became transgender, turned into Hannah Montana, and dated my dad, Billy Ray Cyrus. I want to continue with that storyline. See what happens with that. I feel disturbed. I guess that was the point of this. I'm disturbed. Thanks for disturbing me. Don't forget to subscribe so you never miss another video like this. Comment below if you would switch genders to be with Billy Ray Cyrus. And with that, I'm gonna go. Bye, bitch.